Welcome back to Sky Factory 2.5 So, last time we did some tinkering stuff and today I was thinking about it's time to start doing some automation Yeah, yeah, I had to do some modification because mobs were still spawning inside so now I have on each four side I have this like small window which have a light source hidden as a like the carpenter's block, the same as I told previously on the other side. So first I was thinking about I will be building some lava generating underneath this platform so I can basically automatically fill this tank. So what I will be needing, let's see, first I need the bucket. Here, so I can go up and down. Mm. I think I will be needing two of these. Do I have a wool? Yes, so I'm going to need an elevator block. Do I have can't I Yeah, so I need like eight wool. Mm, I have fourteen uh, thirteen, so I need three more. That's two, three, actually. <laughs> now, oh, wait, I don't know why I needed three, <laughs> not four. Okay, let's put that away. So let's craft these elevators. So now I'm able to go back and forth on those platforms. And then I will need some building blocks. Mm, won't need those two. Those I will. Let's put those away. Actually. Mm. Now it should be okay. Yeah, I think so. And let's see. That's carpenter blocks. I believe this one. Let's put that away. So now. Mm, Have this one. But, wh ah. Yeah, I forgot about that thing. Actually, something came off. Okay, that was odd. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. I think ten would be enough. Let's have a small breathe. I just realized that I should have maybe got the other block ready. Let's hope to be quick. Hmm. I'm gonna check this. That should be 64 when I'm on top. Hmm. Uh, 65 actually. Oh yeah, because of this. Hmm. 
Oh yeah. Uh, let's grab that one. Uh, that should be fifty-five. Yeah, looks to be. Let's. Oh, I just <laughs> realized that I made mistake. I had to put oh. yeah this is really not going so well now I think yeah, that will give some life to me. <laughs> this is really uncomfortable. Okay, now it's working. Okay, now. Okay, so yeah, now this is working. Now I need to build the platform. And I will well, let's use these torches first so so I will be building platform about like like symmetrical and after it's done I'll be back. Okay, so now my platform is ready and this is like symmetrical. So here is where I get in here. And of course I built some fences here, so it will be more safe for me. So what the plan now is, is to make a, a lava generator or actually a couple generator. I think I will make it. Mm. Mm. Actually, if I do it in the center, that block looks like to be. Then I need to add this one. So, yeah, it won't generate anymore. Uh, actually, at the moment, because these are like full blocks. So let's destroy those two and let's make a platform. Okay, so now I have the water part. So I only need the lava, but unfortunately, I I didn't I don't have at the moment. It's coming, so I will be yeah. So yeah, so it will take a little while. Meanwhile, I might as well make a like yaba barrel. See if I remember how to do it. I think I will need a half slab. Uh, doesn't seem like I have one, so let's make one. Okay, so that is done. Now this will hmm, wrong button. Okay, yeah, that's how 
it was okay so now it's locked so it will automatically get those yeah automatically will get couple uh actually i think some sort of light source would be great to have i think let's just put a torch because after I get the lava, I think it should be light this place up a bit more. Mm. Still some time to go. So yeah, I think after that is done, I start working, like make a lava generator and I start trying to make that place work more, so I have this alloy smelter and induction smelter. So I will be working on getting this item conduit and this precious charge fluid conduit. So I will be needing some quartz and this pulsating iron. So that's just iron and the pearls. But this needs some nether quartz. So actually I will be using this ancient spore and making a witch water. Yeah. Yeah, I need to make this stuff. Because I will be needing soul sand. Actually, yeah. Yeah, I need pitch water and sand to get soul sand. So, I will be making those stuff and then I'll be back. Okay, so I have made some progress here. As you can see, I have lots of crucible going here and also I have burning nether wreck. So, why I have, I have that? Is because it gives me three times the amplifier, so I get three times faster. As far as now, torch will give one, uh, lava source will give you two, and yeah, that one gives three, and then pyrotium gives you seven. Uh, this stuff, yeah, placing pyrotium, it gives seven on the like the starting block and. Then the rest will give five. Uh, I don't know if there's other ones that you can use, but as far as now, to those four are able. So how I get netherrack is simple: just getting lava and putting in the stone barrel, adding redstone, and you get some. So it's quite easy to get. Of course it's a bit resource heavy because it uses redstone, which is quite hard to get at start. Or it's quite Yeah, it's yeah, it needs a lot of work. Also I have my little bit lava generator and induction smelter here going on. Actually I could add this one also. So at the moment I had to do this manually. But Eventually I'm hoping to get it work as automatically and I'm thinking about making a second floor on top of this Maybe starting There Or there I don't know yet And then I will be making like a Generators and lots of that kind of stuff. So I'm going to make a other elevator Somewhere here so this is the progress so far and next time and yeah of course I will be building this up for this whole platform of camera but next thing I think you might see as I'm having that second floor done and maybe some other stuff there going on okay so I have built the platform so I made it entirely out of glass as you can see 
Yes, I thought it would be great to see what's going down there. And also, other thing is this one. So what I made is basically a reservoir. So infinite water. It goes to these barrels. Then I have chest, which I will fill with the sand. It will go there, these barrels as now this is mycelium is draining water in the witch water and in the result I will get soul sand. So now I have automated my me uh, a method to get the soul sand so I can get a uh, quartz so I can build good stuff like this reservoir. So yeah, S easy and simple. Okay, time for yet another progress upgrade. So now I have some lava generators coming. Actually, I have. Well, I use these portable tanks to get the lava go up. There's my power, and now I have a auto hammering and auto sieving. Why that is empty? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, yeah, that's not fast enough. So yeah, every sand that breaks here goes straight here. And yeah, because... Actually, yeah, nothing goes... Actually... I don't fully understand why. See if this is correct. Yeah, it should be all working. I guess just because it's not so fast now. I don't have any more diamonds there to get. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, I will get some sand, but. Not until this is full. But yeah, this is what I've been building, and yeah, let's see what next I will come up. Maybe something about a mob farm, but you never know. So, see you soon. Okay, so I've been AFKing a while. I've been building up my storage, so yeah, getting mm, well, somewhat good amount of stuff. Yeah, six diamonds, but also I've been putting these diamonds, uh, diamond hammers, ready. Uh, I'll need to add here two of those. But also, I had this thing. Uh, every single of those tanks are reinforced so 128 buckets of lava in each well this is fooling and also I had that thing in there so as you might see this is basically a obsidian generator that I made so how this works it's just simple well I've been putting these copper walls so it will be Block, preventing that this all of my lava sources won't go away. So, if I want more, just take one wall off, and then it starts coming. It's not very fast, but still, I get good amounts of stuff coming. So yeah, I've been building up that and <laughs> getting like more lava going on. But there's still one thing that I think I'd like to do if I find the right. Yeah. So I am planning to make this aluminite. So basically, I think I'm going to need. Yeah. Five aluminum and some obsidian because I am planning on upgrading my stuff. I have eight 
83 blocks of iron, so I think I think I'll add five gas. Yeah, I have a lot of this. Three, four, five. That. And it was. Yeah, five aluminum and few obsidian. So I will be having a total of ten. And so I need four. Have to be quick. Okay. So yeah. So yeah. Well, now this is away, but soon it will be full again. Yeah, and I need, still need to get. Till my tank is above this block. Yeah, so I had to do something with it at some point. So. Add five toes and four toes. I should, yeah, I should have enough iron. Yeah, let's put the book away. I want to get all of those, so let's see what I'm going to need. I need. To axe head. Let's let's just take a stack of that. Uh, let's see. It was one one of these. Two of. Well, actually, <laughs> I need only one. Sword blade, a pickaxe head. I think that's enough. One, two, three, four different. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> fail. Yeah, I was supposed to throw only one of those away. I don't need that one. Oh yeah, I'm go also going to need some aluminum brass. Okay, so I need more aluminum. I, I think I was... Yeah, well... Let's put other five. Maybe that's enough. Five. As also, I will try to make some more of that brass. If I only remember on what was the receipt. One again. So three and one. So I get. Yeah, okay. And let's get one copper. That should give us enough of that. Okay, we have 12 ingots of that. Hopefully I can go and prepare these already. Almost done. Okay. Eight. Yeah. And 
won't be needing these anymore. Illuminite. So it was. Uh, let's take one of these first. That's axe head. Yeah, it was. Yeah, two axe heads. Ingots back because I will mostly use those. Yeah, I have short blackout. Where's my all pits here? Let's fix our stuff by like this. Oh, I believe that I might not be able to do it. Uh, well, okay, so uh, I can't do it the same time okay I was worried for a while because I wasn't sure if I'm if I was able to do it this on this tool station if I, I was wondering if I had to get tool forge Okay, now I have better weapons. So now this will do 11 or 5 and a half. So, okay, so I can basically one hit mobs now. Except if they have armor. Yeah. So I think this will be. There was a mob somewhere there. I don't know how they spawned there they do yeah I think I will be ending this episode now and but oh yeah first let's see what we have done this is all done second layer is done we have made obsidian upgraded so yeah I think next time we will do these two but yeah, thank you for joining and hopefully see you next time too. Bye.